tell everyone you got bridged. Hello, guys. We got bridged here in Duluth, Minnesota. Right now, the Mishkopa Cotton just field at Husky Field Dock in Duluth, Minnesota. It's leaving to what? What, bud? Two harbors? It's leaving to two harbors, Minnesota. My buddy loves two harbors, Minnesota. It takes two hours from ship. Wow, so cool. Why did it leave so early? Yep, this is how it happened if you left in Duluth. You get bridged here. Hmm, I never want to live in Duluth, but I have to live in Duluth because Duluth is a nice place, so this doesn't make sense. Yo, let's go to the Green Line House. Wait, mom, yeah, actually, actually, actually. 
You have to let us stay. Stay where? Here. Just me and Kaden. No, nope, I do not. What? Nope, I do not. Okay, never mind then. That's weird. Whenever because something happens to you guys. To one fifth foot there. How would I explain because that? I know. I've never seen that. Wait, have I? How do they change the bus? I think they just take the gas. They run out the gas station and then turn it on the out. They didn't load, they didn't unload. Next stop, Two Harbors, Minnesota. What is that? I think ships move faster than humans, actually. I saw this happen before. We saw this happen before. Kaden, we saw this happen before, remember? Yeah. <coughs> it was. Huh? Where are they going to? Two, two harbors? How? How? They go two. They go two hours away. Why? Why not? Because that's weird. There's two harbors back there, right? No, that's not right. Oh, yeah, because if we drive there, we take the, see the land that goes that way, we go that way, all the way along the lake. Do you want to go to, do you guys want to go to Have two harbors? Two harbors yeah. yeah. Okay. Do you guys want to go to two harbors right now after this? I don't care. I don't care. Yeah, let's go. Come on, let's do this. All right, well, let's walk quickly to the lighthouse and then walk quickly back so that we get there. They are, I... The uh, James R. Barker. Because this guy moves, I bet he'll make it in an hour and a half. Who? This guy. This is Mr. Cotton. He's a light. I see me closer. Let's go. Well, James R. Barker is James going to take. Huh? Well, it depends on the speed because if James R. Barker is going slower because it's bigger. Right. This guy moves fast though because he's smaller. No. Yeah, then the James R. Barker. Like, say if that one departs, I think that in the, in the, in the anchored. So if that guy, um, departs, say if it was in the shore, it would move faster than that one, I think, because he's smaller. And then... This Canada one, I think, is bigger than that guy because I think he's smaller than that, or one of them is smaller. Hey, Kaden, what's your favorite place off Duluth? Two Harbors. Two Harbor? I meant, what's your favorite place here in Duluth? The canal. Canal? Mom, how about you? Canal Park. And me is Canal Park. I like it at night. Me too. Monday, I might come back down here for the ship at 8 p.m. and 7 p.m. Not sure. They're coming in at night. Stay tuned to the, to the upcoming stop that I'm doing. Right now, this fog for this lighthouse has a fog horn in it, just in case if it goes off during the fog. That's the reasons why. And stay tuned for soon. I think we might be able to go to the edge. Do not know for sure. Hope they open soon. James R. Barker is the far one. 
Let's go put cotton in as to close this. Kids and so their favorite ship is coming. The Joseph L. Block. Coming in. This is my first time to go to the Yeah, I think I've only been here like once. This is my watch. Yeah. Get fast. Whoa. What's in here? What's in? I think you've seen that. Oh, I see a little dog. I see way far. Yeah, that's uh, James Barker. Yep. Yes. Oh, okay. Yep. Oh, that's bad, yeah. That anchored one is coming on Monday. <laughs> Might be coming on Monday. Not sure. Alright. Ready? Yeah, well. And yeah. See you in the next video.